Good morning, guys. It's Tim from Tim's Adventures. Back underground after my little holiday. Uh, yeah, which was uh, didn't go according to plan. Um, my lights over there have packed it in. So now I've got this one, which I can't do. I'm pretty sure I can't do. Oh no, it seems to be working. All right. Okay. Ah, there it is. The double lines. Yeah. So I'm going to have to put up with that for a little while until I get a new one. If I can find one, that's not going to do that on the video. Right. So we've done that dig and there wasn't much in it. Okay. Now I think probably what's happened is that, yeah. The stuff we pulled out here didn't yield, but see there's billies here and the second wash and that's where I'd say the sapphires are caught in behind the billies. So it's still worthwhile taking and I will take it as I go along here. But now I'm going to hit this part. We'll have a look with a torch here. Okay, and see how she goes. Now, if you can see, there's a mud layer right down the bottom here, and the wash is very thin. But we're still going to take that, and we'll concentrate on taking, taking it from here to there. That's it. That's what we're going to do. Now, there's a layer above that, but um, we'll see as we go what we're going to do with it. I've got to remove this too, and we're going to take that out and focus going that way a little bit and see what happens and hit that ridge we want to hit that ridge okay that's what we want to hit because over this side we got good sapphires and i want to be able to break through into here so we'll see how she goes and then of course we can attack this area as well that's another spot. This is where Tyson was digging. But I don't think he's going to be coming back to this. And there was good sapphires coming out. But of course the best sapphires were in there. Which we've already taken out that ball room. Okay. But. Did get sapphires here. And here with Tyson. But there wasn't any big ones of any great value. So anyhow. We'll take it as it comes. Now, it did rain since I've been back. And it's rained for six, five, six days, which I haven't been able to dig. So, anyhow, the, the water again seeped in. Even though I'll keep sealing this, it just keeps seeping through. Which is a bit of a bugger, because I don't like the water in here. But we're going to hit this now. Get rid of that. Drop this down that and, and this area here so i'll be back with a bit of digging i'll just clean uh drop a bit of that high ground and we'll get going all righty guys round number one knocked down a whole heap i took all the top so uh yeah i didn't see anything but i'm still taking it because i'm pretty sure there's going to be bits and pieces and yeah of little stuff no it's not going to be big probably because there's no big billies or anything up there but i'll still take it and i've got to i've got to drop that sand layer see that layer there that's above that bottom layer yeah that's got to come too and i'm not going to be uh, i'll throw away big pieces like i did over there but the rest of it is kept and that's it you know I've, i did shovel over here but that's all full now I could shovel a little bit over there, but that's not going to happen. It's got to come up with the wash and just the bad luck. All right, well, uh, I'll get rid of all this and then we'll try doing a dig if I can. I, I might drop down a, a quite a bit more there and then we can knock out that billy and I'll be back then. All righty, guys, I've done it. There we go, it's empty. Managed, uh, that was seven wheelbarrows that I knocked down. So, um, first thing that I'll do, I'll tell you right now, is take out this area here. 
for the simple fact, never finished it. It's still got rock in it. So that's number one. Is here. Okay, so I need to where is it? There. Put this one here. That there. And this one here as well. And then after that I'll do that. So yeah. And then I'll go do a wash. I will do a wash and um, we'll do a second wash two two washes in the one okay like we did before so that way we get to see what's in it Not little. Wow. Okay, that's the belly there. Alright, we need to turn this this way. Alright. Now. Oh Jesus. I haven't done weight lifting for a long time. <laughs> okay. Throw that. These bits and pieces over here. We don't need them. Hoppa. All right, let's have a look what's what is behind here. Yep, there it is. That's the wash there. Here. fix this issue here okay let me just think I'm gonna have to put a because we can't see so I can't see properly right and I'm gonna put a pin over here that way it's uh Break it off. Bend that back a bit. Okay. So we're gonna whack it here. Right. Sit there. It's only temporary. This won't last long. Let's do it, that's better. Now we can see. Now I can see. Okay. 
did the big basher for this. Look at that while I was growing the rust. Right. You know, when it comes to these sort of areas where it's concrete like this, sometimes you, you get lucky and you get big stones. They're going to be big and dark, but it's all sapphire. <laughs> I don't mind. Like I'm talking 70 plus carat sizes in this sort of ground. I saw a bit of black then. I think I hit it with the hammer. Uh, black sparkle. Now, here of course would would be the titanium, you know. But you know, every time I seem to mention something that's supposed to be here, I end up getting hardly anything. So hopefully, you know. Doesn't make me look silly. <laughs> okay, we can get rid of that. By the looks of it, this was a gutter along here, and they followed the gutter. And what's happened, I think that's the up where the end of this is going to be, and that's why they stopped. They were following the gutter, and the gutter stopped up further, started going on a rise. So they stopped. Definitely looking like that because it's dropping down that way. That way it's been backfilled with rock. Okay.
Especially when it comes to the ground like this. Okay. Oh. I have to find the cracks to get to this wash I mean to try to break it to get to it yeah I really enjoyed that holiday that was great by the way <laughs> um, yeah disappointing of course that things didn't pan out the way I wanted them to you know um, yeah but when you get told by the dealers themselves and uh, yeah, what the situation is oh yeah by the way <laughs> just here now um, a few people came over and there was a gentleman from Canterbury that came an older gentleman that's uh, dealing with sapphires for the last 25 years a Thai man okay bought came here through the channel of course got to know me but he's uh he came here many many years ago and was dealing with uh Mo mosley mosley sold his mine but anyhow and uh yeah he bought some stone off me so i had a good conversation and uh about thailand and so forth and i told him exactly what i got told and that, you know, people are going to try to cheat me out to laugh about it, you know, you know, I, uh, you know, the truth is the truth and that's the best way to tell it. And he had no qualms at all, of course. And, um, yeah, so I got to hear very good from him and he asked me if, if I was ever back in Thailand, like, you know, to pop in and see him and uh, that he'd be interested in buying more stones. So, yeah, uh, there you go. Now I'm starting to meet. And, and possibly legit people, but yeah. <sighs> but I will be doing my own thing, as I have been, and even more.
getting through. There's a rock there, that's why. dealing with this sort of ground for a long time many years since I came here of course um yeah it can be most of the time it's crap <laughs> but you know you got your rare times that it comes out good But we do know that this does yield, so it's just a matter of hope and a prayer that it yields something good. Not just crap. guys I'm going to clean this up get rid of it and then I'm going to start over here and I'll be back once I clean it up
hard stuff. <laughs> pebble but that's why we want a pebble of sapphire a beautiful golden yellow or blue on white yeah This is going to take a long time to dig this out. This ain't going to be easy. Concrete's coming out. Ah, there's a it's a rock. I thought it was a I thought it was concrete. It's still concrete around me. Now I know I don't have to try to break it. Yeah, the holiday was so good that uh, it ended too quickly. Yeah, I was just enjoying, enjoying spending money. <laughs> yeah.
Ah, I forgot about you guys, sorry. All right, guys, uh, I'm going to continue here. Finish off and I'll see you upstairs. We'll, we'll have a look what it yields and then we'll do the second load and then clean it out. So, see you up there. <sighs> Alrighty guys, dug out. That's gone. Now, we'll dig around that rock and get the stuff out. We only got two and a half wheelbarrows to go. And, oops, sorry. And job done. Break it as I go. That's pretty deep. Didn't expect that. See that iron in the in the granite. That's what you gotta be careful of. Not be careful, I mean if you see it, dig it out. <laughs> because if the iron was able to penetrate the granite. That means the granite was soft and that means sapphire would have penetrated too. Yeah. 
But if there was lots of it, I would see it. It would be visual here. Okay, this is not a little rock. Over this side it looks small, it goes down, down that way. That's clinker, uh, that iron stone stuck in it, and that's decomposed. Oh, that could be ochre. <laughs> Alrighty, guys, look. So I cleaned the tubs out. They were chock a block. I won't be doing that again. Another thing I, I keep making a mistake is not to clean it out. And I should have cleaned out the mud over there. I redone this as soon as I came back. So that should be right. And there we go. Pull up. And this one. And let rock and roll. Now this is all dry dirt, so it will go through quickly. Okay, that's enough. Now I try to remove this, but because of the rain, of course I, all I did was get bogged and made a big mess. So yeah, learn my lesson. Don't leave it like that. Alright, uh, we'll turn the water on. So 
believe there should be like titaniums in there because get a little bit of bottom. Most of it is just hot, so we'll see what happens. We'll find out soon enough in a minute. Back shortly with the finish point. Alrighty guys, first 11 wheelbarrows done. We'll just have a sticky beak if we've got anything in this wash. Again, not expecting much, but hoping for something at least. Okay, spinel. Alright, that looks like not much here. This is spinel. <laughs> oh god. Hmm. Yeah, we've got bad stuff. Alrighty. Nothing in that. Absolutely not one. That's amazing. Okay. So now I'm just gonna dig out the bottom and uh, try a bit more and we'll see how we go. I'm gonna go for lunch and then go back down underground and uh, we'll do a second reload and, and see what happens. Hi right, guys, back underground. Do a few more wheelbarrows for the load, and uh, I'll just show you where I'm at. Okay, oops. I've touched the. There we go. So it's going to move our billy out. I've already broken it loose. Amazingly, it come off quite easy, but I had to put a bigger pick on. So I can get him behind and move it a little bit. Yeah. Because uh, there's got to be a couple hundred kilos in that at least. I'd say probably more. I have to lever it. <laughs> yeah, okay. <clears throat> I have no idea. Wow, oh, okay, she's fairly deep. Not try to move it this way. <clears throat> Good morning guys, it's the next day. What's happened is, I removed that billy with great difficulty, but the camera went off, the battery died. So I did a bit more digging, and that's the result. It actually puffed me out, moving that big bugger. This has got to be over 200 kilo for sure, plus some. Anyhow, so I'm going to break this up and, and dig some more of that dirt, and do another 11 wheelbarrows, and then we'll see what the result is. Or I'll try to do 11 anyhow. I, I want to dig that area out too. I haven't seen anything. As you could see in the pulsator there was nothing in it. So hopefully there might be something in this to add to it. Alright, back shortly. Alright guys. It's empty. Last one. This is number 9. So that's it. So 11 and 9, 20 total, and uh, I'll see you guys upstairs. We'll see what this does, but I'm not digging anymore here. It's just too hard, and the amount of stone, it's just not worth it at the moment. So, you know, I'll leave that for later on, another day, and uh, try somewhere else. Alright guys, starting up, that's the leftover from the last wash. And uh, here we go, hopefully something in it, but decided going to move from that spot, I get nothing, nothing worthwhile. 
I don't want to dig for nothing. That's it. So after this wash, moving to another spot. Okay. That's what's the finished product. All right, guys, job done. Hopefully that will tighten that down. See if we get anything. I don't like the chances. No zero confidence. <laughs> Which is pretty bad. Well, that's uh, okay. Look at that. Yeah. Well, at least the silicon didn't come apart. Okay, in one go. Funny, I keep thinking this is going to be a short video because of the terrible result of the last 11 wheelbarrows so it's 20 wheelbarrows I, and I'm hesitant, hesitant to go through it and uh, yeah, just to be disappointed with nothing <sighs> okay we'll let the camera take over all right guys this is it. First wash of coming back. Spinel.
Penel. <laughs> uh, this is a. Uh, And I was expecting to see a lot of titanium and uh, yeah, zircon. So that just goes to tell me that in that section that I am digging, nothing went past. Okay, there's a one sapphire. That's it. Okay, and <laughs> a second zircon, and we have a tiny little sapphire there. Yeah, definitely be moving to another spot. I don't know if I want to go back yet to the old spot. Yet. Because there's another spot that I wanted to give it a, tr give it a try. And, uh, yeah, see what that's like. Okay, a little star sapphire. Tiny, tiny. You'd, you'd think that giant billy around it would be quite a bit of sapphire because uh, yeah there was sapphire right at the beginning of this and then it just uh, they ran away they grew legs and disappeared okay the last bit okay another little piece of nothing <laughs> And another piece of dud. Okay. And last bit, guys. This is it. Okay. It's not going to happen, this wash. Definitely not. Okay, that's it. That's the worst wash so far, I believe. And one of the hardest too. So here we go. Alright. We'll leave it at that, guys. Um, oh, I can't lean back, otherwise I'll fall over. Anyhow, I'm going to do some tractor work. And get rid of that today. So no more digging. And uh, what can I say? But uh, new spot next. And hopefully some nice sapphires. We'll find out tomorrow. Alright guys, like, share, subscribe, ring that notification bell, thumbs up. God bless you all. See you on the next one. Bye for now.